Hello everyone, Crystal Vizier here and welcome to another Spyro Reignited Trilogy video, a Spyro Enter the Dragonfly mod video. And here we are with the beautiful Luau Island as modeled and as reignited, brought to life by Ghosty and Infinite Extrema. Absolutely gorgeous. So you guys may have seen the previous video, obviously when we were going over, what was the level? It was, um, you know, I called it Dragon Shores on Twitter, but actually it's, uh, uh, you know, Dragon Realms. And this is the second level they've decided to preview to me. This just looks fantastic. Just the little things like water and stuff like that, it just, it goes so well with this vibe. Like, I don't know, just something about it is just looks so nice. I was looking at some of the my comparison shots just before I was filming and I'm like, oh my god, just little things to the lighting, little things to, like little effects like the water effects like this, it just, it goes such a long way, uh, you know, with modern, with modern technology. Now, a few little things to quickly bring up in between the filming of this video and the latest video. So, obviously, Ghosty and Infinite Extrema have been reading the comments. Uh, I spoke to Ghosty, sounds like they're very happy with some of the feedback that we've gotten. Oh, look at this. By the way, I'm going to use the console injector, which is a program you can download, and go FOV86. There you go. See, now I get a little bit more of a view in my screen. I think, I think it actually goes a really long way. So, they've been reading the comments. And yes, they've definitely seen some of the stuff about, you know, what's what about the idea of using some of the more modern reignited textures for some of the, you know, for, for the game? Like, why don't you maybe use some of them instead of using some of the older textures? Why don't you, why don't you do that kind of thing? And they're absolutely listening. Um, whether they're going to do that remains to be seen. Obviously, it will probably create... I mean, it would probably create a lot of work at the same time it's already in the, in the game, so I don't know. Um, this is their project though, and I think the other thing to remember, the other thing to consider is that... Um, what's the word? Like, it's it's something that's going to be sort of one step at a time, you know? Like, it's not, it's going to be, a, it's a hard project. This is a long and hard project, and they're nowhere near done. So, I think that it's going to be step-based. So, you may see like a version 1.0 that'll be, you know, really, really nice. But then after that, you know, they may be doing, they may add stuff later. They may go a bit more detailed later. One thing they are going to be doing though that is planned is to add a little bit more depth to some of the levels in terms of background and stuff like that. For example, I'm assuming the skybox is not final. Uh, this is like an old, I don't even know what kind of skybox it is. Look at the Look at the clouds. But so, for example, what I'd be doing is, yeah, I'd be putting these little islands in the background out of, out of here. You know, pretty far away so you can barely see it. You don't have to model it in super detail. You could probably use some stuff from Reignited. Um, I'm not going to complete the level 100%, by the way, or even close. I'm just going to I'm gonna run through it a little bit faster because the full video, you know, when this is all out, I'll do like a whole, a whole let's play of it, you know what I mean? Let's go through here, though. Unlock the code. Oh, look at the lighting in here. Oh, that's beautiful. I know you guys have been absolutely loving it and really all the feedback is appreciated. Um, please be sure to follow them all on. Okay, I was just listening to see if I could hear that. It's not very loud. Um, yeah, be sure to follow them on Twitter and, you know, check out their all of their projects and stuff like that. And go on ModDB and download some mods and, you know, just... Yeah, the Spyro community right now is thriving. We may not have a new game yet, although I'm sure, you know, within the year we should probably have an announcement, judging by how it's all been going. Um, but yeah, it's honestly, it's it's fantastic. All right, let's do this. Opens that door. How good, how good that the camera works and everything like that. And playing this in like flawless 60 FPS with just everything, you know, in HD, it's just... It's so satisfying. Now, another thing people have brought up, uh, there's there's light gems in here. What the hell is that? Firstly, one, is that a teaser for um, A Hero's Tale? And the answer to that one is Ghosty loves A Hero's Tale, especially the model and stuff. So who knows about that? We'll, uh, we'll keep that one quiet. We'll see. But then the other thing is... Um, 
is uh, will there be the dragonflies? Or, or are we just, is it just like crazy sort of thing? Is he just like using light gems because why not? And that is something that is being actively worked on. Look at that, it actually works. Awesome. I've never done that before. That is so great. What about, I'll get this one. So yeah, the collectibles right now, not final, not sure. D who knows if we'll be able to have bubble breath. There is, look at this. See? There is technically bubble breath in the code. So that's that becomes a question of, can we do it? How can it work? You know, what's gonna happen there? Bubble breath was very glitched. Like it was a very bizarre thing. Oh wow. I don't think running water is fully figured out yet, as you can see with this. It seems a little bit jelloy looking at this. Yeah, I don't think that's a that's a that's a finished product uh, yet, but that's okay. I love I love of course lifting these guys from uh, you know uh, what's the level called? What am I what am I trying to say? I was gonna say cloud spires, that's completely wrong. Idle springs, there you go. I know guys, I, I know Spyro. I know fake fan. I fan real. <laughs> it's hilarious hearing that sound effect though. I'm not gonna lie, it's absolutely hilarious. Um, what are these things? Are they just set dressing? This is a level portal. See, if I were them, I'd, I'd go all in and just create some random new section. That's what I'd do, but probably don't have the time to do that. All right, let's head on through here. Let's head off to the bluest. It's just so surreal to see this though. Like that's the big thing for me. And it's also surreal that some of the textures look really, really great. Some of them just look okay, but some of them, yeah, some of them genuinely look okay. And all the enemies, like they actually fit, even though they're basically lifted from other places, but they, you know, some of them are modified as well, so. Light gem. Okay, where are we going now? Set up here. See, look, all the grass being like this is just perfect. It's so perfect. Look at that. Wah, 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 wah. Okay, so how do you... Make it through there. You gotta go up here. I haven't played in I haven't played Enter the Dragonfly for such a long time. I haven't played it for such a long time that I've I've forgotten. I've all but forgotten. Now right, what? Is I just like not able to get it? Now Obviously there's no breaths yet as well. That's going to be interesting though, because the breath thing is especially going to be interesting because, you know, how are, they going to, how are you going to be able to just freeze every enemy? Like, is that going to be possible? Hmm. So. Just wondering here, am I locked out for good now? Let me think. Or is this, this whole chain... Does that work? Like, I wonder if that works. Let me see. I'm gonna go down and, and just check. I'm gonna check, see if it works. I've got a feeling it's probably... I've got to assume it doesn't. Let's... See, is there any more over there? Is there? Wait. Can't remember. Okay, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna go all the way over here. I'm just gonna start and see what happens. Oh. Uh -huh. Got me. Alright, okay. Here we go. <laughs> this is the moment of truth, folks. It's the moment of truth, folks. This is what happens, folks. Jim Ross. Alright, here we go. Is anything gonna happen for me doing this? Is anything at all? Come on. Hoping for the best, expecting the worst. Here we go. Nothing. 
So unless I am missing something major, I genuinely don't know what, I genuinely don't know if I can open that door. Because obviously you notice there isn't any NPCs. So, as far as I know, I think that's basically it. There we go. Look at that. Well guys, it's been a pleasure. This has been Luau Island so far. Expect plenty, well expect more to come uh, at a later date, we'll see. Might be a few months away, but I do thank you all for your support and make sure you go and push that support over outside of this channel um, to Spyro creators and modders and hackers everywhere. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you later.